people, I am here to let everyone know that Jesus is God. He died for our sins. She is funny. She is talking about Jesus being God. Probably she is getting paid for doing this. Yes, she is funny. A joke. Jesus is the only way to heaven. There is eternal punishment for those who reject Jesus. That eternal punishment is hellfire. She has now started threatening people by talking hell. Let me teach her a lesson. Well, I think she is just talking about God and the punishment God can give to man. Don't tell me you have become a Christian by her words. I don't want to be friends with those who are religious and serious about God. No, I am just saying what she meant. Well, never mind. Good. Well, let me deal with her, so that she learns a lesson not to scare people. Hey lady, who gave you the authority to speak about God in public? Well, I was a person who did not believe God. But now, God saved me and it is my responsibility to speak about the salvation I received, to everyone. I did no harm to anyone. Bible says, there is no other name by which a man can be saved, except the name of Jesus Christ. You are making me angry by speaking about Jesus. I will kill you. Well Bible says, Fear not them which kill the body, but are not able to kill the soul, but rather fear him which is able to destroy both soul and body in hell. Matthew, 10, 28 I rather fear God. Well, then I'll show you what fear is. Jesus, forgive her for what she did. Friend, I think it was cruel of you to slap her. Well, she should know that all cannot like what she says. That would have taught her a lesson. Only a fool would believe what she says. But I feel there is truth in what she is saying. Carla, I have told you already that I cannot be friends with those who are trying to be godly. You surely will lose many friends by trying to be godly. I hope you don't become a fool. Life is to enjoy the way you like. I know many Christians who restrict themselves from enjoying and they are just wasting their life. Well okay I don't want to talk about it. Let's meet up tomorrow. Bye now. I can't sleep. I feel I need to know about Jesus more. I feel there is truth in what she is saying. But at the same time, I don't want to lose my friends in this world. They are more important to me. Let me go and hope that I can see that lady tomorrow. I hope my friends don't see me anywhere. Dear people, you are all created by God. God came down from heaven to save man and gave his life for man. Hi, I came here hoping to see you. Thank God I found you. Hi, aren't you the one who was with the lady, who slapped me? What makes you come to me again? Well I am sorry for what she did. I couldn't sleep yesterday and I wanted to ask you about Jesus. Why do you say he can save us? What can he save me from? Well, every person is a sinner. A sinner cannot be found in heaven. But because of the love of God for man, God came down from heaven, born in the womb of a virgin. His birth was without sin, he knew no sin, he did no sin. Yet he gave himself for us who are sinners, that we might be cleansed from our sins by his blood. All we need to do is to believe that he is God and he died for our sins, and ask him to forgive. He is faithful and just to forgive us. He is the true avatar who came from heaven. Wow, I feel there is no greater truth than this. I believe in Jesus now. But at the same time, I am afraid that my friends will hate me if I accept Jesus. Well Bible says, Know ye not that the friendship of the world is enmity with God. Whosoever therefore will be a friend of the world is the enemy of God. James, 4, 4 Jesus himself was rejected of men. We who follow Jesus, may also face rejection and hatred. But God will be with us. Thank you so much for making me understand. I want Jesus in my life, and even if I need to face hatred from my friends, I don't care. All I need is Jesus. I am happy for you. May God be with you and bless you. Thank you. Hey Carla, the class is over and it's the weekend. Shall we go and watch the new movie Avatar on Sunday? Well, I am not coming. 
I found that Jesus is the true avatar who came down from heaven. He is God who came down from heaven for us, and was born as a man and gave himself for us. I rather worship God on Sundays. Well, I warned you already not to talk about Jesus or try to be godly. You will lose my friendship if you do so. I'll tell all other classmates to not keep company with you. Well I know this was coming. I need Jesus more than anything or anyone. He is my God. I am leaving now. Bye. Did you see how Carly accepted Jesus and how she was filled with the love of God that she was ready to lose everything but not Jesus? St. Paul said, For I am persuaded that neither death, nor life, nor angels, nor principalities, nor powers, nor things present, nor things to come, nor height, nor depth, nor any other creature, shall be able to separate us from the love of God, which is in Christ Jesus our Lord. Romans 8, 38, 39 Jesus is the true God and true avatar who came in the flesh as man and gave himself for us. Let us believe on him and be filled with his love, so that nothing shall separate us from the love of God. God bless you all. Subscribe for more inspirational videos.